Eight wagons of beer. Holy shit, man. You better unload everything over there. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Railwell Empire. I'm Nirmai, to today, ladies and gentlemen. We'll be taking a look at the new DLC for the game. And ladies and gentlemen, we are going upside down. Because today, exactly, we'll be playing a DLC called Down Under, which, as you've noticed already on the screen, takes us all the way to the good old Australia, I think, right? I don't even know how to do a proper accent of that thing, so I'm gonna try to avoid doing that, okay? For the future notice, so yeah. Basically, we're moving our asses out of Europe, we're moving our asses out of the United States, and we're going to one of the British oldest prison colonies. Well, it used to be a British prison colony, right? Technically, like they've dropped it, what? Convicts and bunnies over there. That's actually quite interesting. Right, so how do I even load that thing? Uh, not over here, I guess. So I have to probably go to this scenario. Okay. Uh, right, so we got how many? We got one. Okay, and it's on this side. Down under. <laughs> okay, this looks interesting. I haven't actually finished, I think, completely any of the DLCs. Maybe at some point in my game, uh, in my life, I should try to go to, you know, like the older saves and try to finish them. Probably. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. But for now, the ladies and gentlemen, down under. In the first half of the 19th century, the colonial areas of Australia contained in a few towns scattered along the coast and a few smaller farms on the outback. Not exactly a place where one would expect to emerge an industrial revolution. However, Appearances are deceptive, because of a chain of events will be set in motion that will bring irrelevant changes and catapult Australia into a success future soon. Well, looking forward to that. Oh, we're gonna start at the very bottom. Uh, right, I'm gonna go with pause mode. I don't remember which one I usually do. I think it was manual? Yeah, it was manual. And realistic? Trains must wait for each other. Normal. Trains can pass by each other without causing any traffic issues. Normal. Oh. The AI only uses the regular track network, but has to pay more. Oh! I never knew there was option like this actually over here. And I think we are going with the general. Right? Well, because he has less track construction, uh, we're gonna have to pay more for tunnels and bridges. I don't think we have to pay Together, that much for those? Them all. I mean, Australia is pretty fucking empty if you think about it. I don't know, we'll see. Okay, let's, without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let us go on the rail! Ah, lovely. Ah, hello. How did you end up here? T you tell me. What was that? Railroads? Here in the middle of nowhere? You must have suffered a heat stroke. Well, since you're here, there are actually a few things a railroad might prove helpful with. But heed my warnings, and don't come running to me if you fail. Okay, wait. Aren't you the guy that used to, you know, play with animals? The most dangerous one? You know how that thing went, right? Look at that! There's a... Uh, uh, how it went? A real cobra! The most poisonous snake in the world! I'm gonna touch it! Something like that. What was that name of that guy? I've forgotten completely. I think he died like a few years back, didn't he? Poor soul. Right, so what exactly I need to do over here? Tasks. Okay, so I have... I got basically f two years to finish. Connect two cities to the raid network. <laughs> uh, connect three rural businesses and... Connect 55,000 people to your raid network. How the fuck am I supposed to do that thing? Excuse me. Can I start over here? I don't think I can start over there. Can I start over there? And also, I see mountains. Ah, shit. Just when I thought I won't have to deal with mountains, the first thing I see in front of my face is a bloody ass mountain. Right, so I got two cities over here. Uh, right, you guys need cattle. Right, and you're gonna give me meat. And what does you need? Okay, you need meat. You need wood. You need whatever this thing is. And you need some grain. Okay, we got grain over here. Wood over here. Cattle. Cattle's over there and it's grayed out, so I cannot do anything with that thing, I guess. Wait, does the grayed out mean... Yeah, there's a bunch of grey out things here and there. And I'm guessing I cannot interact with them just yet. Well, that's a bit of a problem. I wonder how this thing is gonna develop. Right, and... Ah, we got something over here. Okay, boys! Right, build my first station, you don't say. Okay, I think I'm gonna go with this one. Right, because we're gonna have two connections anyway, and upgrading this thing later on is gonna be a pain in the ass anyway. Or maybe I should try to go with four right away. Can I afford it? 
How are we gonna do this thing exactly? Can't build over there. I don't think there's a passage. Yeah, there's a small passage for this thing, but I would not exactly trust it. I think I will have to go all the way around. Oh, we also got this thing over here. Okay, good. Right, so you know what? I think for now we're gonna try to work on, on these small cities, and then we're gonna just, you know, climb our way to victory, so... One big stage. First we have established a station in hometown, Melbourne. Oh, come on! Really? Okay. I'm gonna make you... I'm gonna give you a small sta trade station, because there's nothing I could try to connect over here to. Yeah, I'm not gonna go for the fucking mountains, forget about that. Then we're gonna build a big station over here. Which is gonna... Actually, you know what? I screwed up. Hold on a second. I screwed up really bad, because... Uh, upgrading this thing later on is gonna be a pain in the ass, so I'm gonna go with this uh, control signal thingies. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the control signal thingies. So one goes over here. It's a bit more expensive, but later on it's just gonna be worth it. Uh, large shade station... Yeah, you're gonna go here. There we go. Okay, so I can connect those two. Okay, now we got... Resources. Maintenance station. Signals. Small train station. Yeah, I'm gonna build you probably over here. Like, let's say... Can I build you there? Why? Can I build you here? I can build you here. Okay. So I'm gonna build you, because later on the train tracks are gonna go from here around. And they're gonna probably go here. So making an intersection over here is gonna be a valid option. So let's say I'm gonna build you... Come on, allow me to build! This? Okay, and that means we're gonna need a warehouse. For that thing. But I need a warehouse with controls. Should I try to go with the big warehouse or with the small warehouse? I think the small warehouse should be enough. So the small warehouse, if the chains are gonna go like that... Eventually, you will have to do... So you're gonna be connected like... This. I hope this is not a bad idea. It is possibly a potential bad idea. Shit. How am I gonna do this thing? Because I really prefer that the trains won't use this thing as a shortcut later on. So maybe do it like this instead. Something like this, I guess. Yeah, that should work. Beautiful! Now let's get into connecting, so... This one is gonna get connected... To this one over here. I cannot... What? How much money? You fucking kidding me. What the shit, man? Why is it so expensive? Oh, okay, now I see why. Mountains. Of course. See? All of a sudden, like, going down from 1,200,000, I just went to 77,000. Sure, why not? Since the first settlements were founded just over 40 years ago, not much has changed here. Do you really think that a few tracks will change anything? Dude, you'll be surprised. You'll be surprised how much a few tracks can change something. Now obviously we have to set up some train connections over here. I cannot move. Right, you'll be transporting passengers and mail only. And locomotive of this guy. Okay, and then we have to set up some train connections from this place as well. Okay, still have enough money, so I should this I think this should be possible if I'm gonna do something like this. There we go. Sweet. Okay, go all the way. All the way over here. Right, so later on we won't have difficulties in connecting new tracks and stuff and that. Okay, now you. You're gonna go here and you're gonna connect to this train track. Like such. And you, you're gonna connect to the other one. Sweetness! It's going along so nicely! Hell yeah! And now the only thing for me remaining to do is put some signals over here, you know? Because we all know that we don't want this thing to go completely fucking bollocks. So, one signal is gonna be... Here. One signal is gonna be... Here. Like this? Yeah. Okay, and then we just have to go... Screen size... Like this. More or less. You know, it's not, no, no, nobody's gonna be, like, drinking from this thing or whatever. So it doesn't really matter, like, if I'm gonna have one shorter and one longer. As long as, more or less, one train with full squad will be able to fit over here. Like, with full amount of wagons, um, carts or whatever. Then this should be completely fine. Okay, this one is ready. 
and on the opposite side. So uh, you're gonna get blocked like this. Okay, and then we're gonna make thingy over here, I guess. Like this. Yeah, like this. Okay, then you're gonna go block this thing just in case. And then from the opposite side. Okay, and then we're gonna just continue. Okay, can I tell the trains to start going? No, I'm because I'm building. So I cannot start the game. I just have to finish building first and I guess go on this thing later on. So just keep on building, boys. Just keep on building. There we go. Yeah, I know it's tedious a bit, but you have to do this thing. Otherwise, the trains will just go crazy and you won't be able to achieve anything. Trust me, I went through this thing already. Okay, block this thing. Block this thing. And more or less, uh, stop thingy over here. Stop thingy over here. There you go. Beautiful. Okay. And a stop thingy. Like here. Right? Like this? Yeah, it should be fine. Okay. Righty. Allow the trains to go now. Uh, don't need this. Don't need this. Okay, he's loading grain. So he's gonna drop it at the warehouse. This train is gonna make a test run here and there. And after that, return for more grain. Which is gonna be great. And we need to later on provide it with some cattle. Ah, the first mail is already going around. That's nice. And as soon as this warehouse is gonna get filled with some seafood, I guess. Speaking of the devil. Nice. I have to establish another train that's gonna be going from this warehouse to those two cities over there. After we're gonna accumulate some money, it's gonna be time for expansion. Speaking of expansion, uh, okay, I need to connect three more businesses. And I need to connect basically one more city to get the objective done. That should be easy. Increase the reality of your locomotives by 6%. For 6,000? Sure! Why not? Come on. Drop it. Drop it, drop it, drop it like you mean it. Okay, where's the stuff? I don't see the stuff. It should be on pallets outside of the fucking warehouse and I don't see it. Okay, wait, never mind. And establish a train, new locomotive. Because right now we don't need to have that many deliveries. One locomotive should be more than enough to fulfill this thing. There we go. Okay, load up, boy! You're going on an adventure. What adventure? To the city. How far? Not far. Oh, man. Yeah, I know. Move it! Choo-choo, dipshits. All right. And how's the thing going over here? Oh, the locomotive with grain, without grain, has arrived. Whatever train reaches the city, freight, mail, and passengers will be unloaded. The rising number of represents. Yeah, there, there, there. Nobody cares. How's my grain supply? Eight. And it's growing. I'm starting to think that actually we're gonna need more trains over here right away. Uh, or maybe not. As soon as that other stupid train is gonna return on its duty. That's a lot of mail. Holy shit! And passengers! I was not expecting that many passengers right away. <laughs> and they sell making they say that making a railroad in the middle of nowhere is a bad idea. <laughs> Pathetic. Look at the smart ass transporting eight carts of fucking eight for yeah, eight carts of fucking beer. Eight wagons of beer. Holy shit, man. You better unload everything over there. Good job. 16,000 for that thing. <laughs> money. That's how you make my Here goes another one. Dude, what the shit? You not you don't need to deliver that many. Holy crap. Came to the point where I need to take a loan. <laughs> and I need to take a loan fast. Uh, okay, company, right, where is the loan thingy? Okay, there it is, right, I want to take... I think I'm gonna take this one. Uh, yep, thank you for the money. Okay, so now I can continue building. So, we're gonna add this thing here. Okay, now I just need to connect this thing to this thing here somehow. Right, now this is gonna be the most expensive part because I have to make a bridge over this. Stupidity, and also I have to make later on this track here, right? And I already ran out of money. Shit. Okay, well, time for another loan, I guess. Okay, right. Let's give me the big one, maybe. Is that a good idea? Yeah, let's take the big one. Yeah, money, 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 money. Okay. 
You're gonna go through the fucking desert, just like that. More or less. Okay, and then once you're gonna go here... Okay, actually, hold on a second. What I just did... Oh, wait, I did it right, okay. Because later on there's gonna be a truck going here, right? So I need to connect you. So you have to go the bridge. The bridge needs to be somewhere over here, not this. Grab this. Yeah, the bridge needs to be somewhere over here. Like this. Okay, that works. Okay, and you're gonna go that way later on, because later on we're gonna get connected to that city there, I hope. So you have to probably make another bridge, but that's gonna be the thing I'm gonna worry about later on. Okay, and now make the other side of the truck. 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 Same thing. Whatever. Oh, I'm out of money already. Son of a bitch! There's all commodities to transport. But you still seem determined. Yep. Okay, now we just have to crawl a little bit the people and everything will be okay, I hope. Gonna make a smart intersection over here because... Uh, well, I only can afford right now only one track. Reasons. Money. <laughs> Pathetic. Okay, where's the train I've ordered? What the shit? Hold on a minute. Where's the train? Warehouse 3. I didn't set up the train? Oh, come on, man. Okay, we need to wait for some money to get ourselves the train. So he's gonna fill up the storage, and after that we're gonna get another train. That's gonna be basically delivering the wood to the towns. I hope. Come on. Give me cash. Money. I need money now. Money. Hello. I don't see any money. You guys can't be this slow. Come on, faster, move it, move it, move it. Jump, jump, boys. That is progressing a little bit faster, you have to admit. Uh, okay, we just need to add ourselves one more train. So set up train connection from here to here. Security guard. Yeah, I don't care right now. Thank you very much. Okay, get the John Cook. Right. Okay. So all the cities are not supplied with the sources. The only thing for me is now to wait. 5,000 people. I need to accommodate 5,000 people somehow. Yo, I cannot do anything else. We just need to deliver the resources and grow the cities. I have to do this thing. Well, I have to do it by the end of this year, so move on! Come on! A bit faster! I'm starting to think that I've screwed up somewhere. I may have accidentally screwed up. A little tiny bit. A little tiny bit. Just a little bit. What the fuck you... Oh my god! Jesus, thank Christ. You really don't have to be waiting all the way, you know? You could be... Be on your way, like, hours ago. Maybe I've built a bit too expensive train stations or something like that. I mean, I should still be able to do this thing, right? Are you planning to go anytime soon? You're blocking the entire thing! Never mind! I know it's maybe hard for you to believe, but wood at the moment is more important than your stupid ass seafood. Okay, there he goes. He goes to the other station. And the other train with the other thingy should be arriving very soon as well. I may actually try to fail this thing. You know, it has been a while since the last time I played this game. Uh, okay, what you doing? What you lacking? You're just lacking wood and grain. Somehow you're lacking grain. How the fuck you lacking grain? That's wood. That's grain. How the fuck you lacking grain over here? No, this, this is a serious question. How in the fucking name you are lacking grain? You can't be using that much of a grain. I think. Right? Hope so. Jesus, thank Christ. Okay, delete all of those because they are just, you know, standing in my way. Imports. Yeah, now we're lacking seafood. What the actual shit, man. You really want me to throw one more train over here? Ugh. Apparently that's what's gonna happen, boy. This, this city is growing. Uh, 5,000 people. Uh, it's October. I don't remember. Do I have to do this thing by the end of this year or, or by the end of the next year? Well... We're gonna find out in basically two months. What? Increases profits from transport. Yeah, sure. Why not? Give me all of the profits you can. Every single fucking profit is, is welcome right now. 
You guys planning to give me something cool? Come on! That'll be a good moment to do right now! Uh, 4,000 people. Well, what did I tell you? Australia's a tough place for railroad companies. Well, first attempt has been failed, ladies and gentlemen. Nobody said that this scenario is gonna be easy. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> but okay, we've almost did it. I think the f I, I I believe that what I screwed up was uh, what I screwed up was I think I went I should have got the loan right at the beginning and get the other station in order like also at the beginning. That would probably be a better option. Oh well, you know how what they say: you learn some, you achieved some. So we're gonna try to restart this thing during the next time because right now I'm running out of record time So I think this is actually a good moment uh, to restart this thing anyway But yeah, if you want to try this thing yourself There's gonna be a link in the description below to the base game and if you like what you're gonna see If you up to the challenge There are gonna be like lots of DLCs with different maps, different train models, uh, a bit different resources But all in all it goes to the same theme, right? So you bring certain resources uh, the city expands, so then you have to provide them with new resources, and so on and so forth, right? So at the beginning, as you saw, I had to provide those guys with grain, with uh, with cattle, which I don't have access yet, to wood, uh, to seafood, and to, to beer that one of the cities is making, right? And with that thing, the city expands, it grows, increases its people. I bet that I had like 50, 52,000, something like that, right? No, I'm gonna go back to my menu. Shit, I cannot even check that thing. God damn it. But yeah, more or less I know what I need to do. So next episode is gonna be us going full out and we're gonna conquer Australia like there is no tomorrow. But that's gonna be the thing, ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna leave for the next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the next episode. Please a lot. I'll see you in the next video.